It's the new year, which means that gym memberships are skyrocketing, and here in a few months, gym membership cancellations will be skyrocketing. I've never been one to really do New Year's resolutions, because I think that if you need 365 days to decide to be a better person, you're just a terrible person. But I thought that this would be the perfect time to go ahead and share ones that I came up with this year. Some of them are real, some of them are funny. I'll let you decide. To start off, I need to stop sarcastically telling people that I fuck with Andrew Tate because I think the little elves in my phone are starting to take me seriously. At first, I liked a couple videos about him on TikTok because I thought he was satire. I thought there's no way someone with this, I these ideas could be serious, you know? He in fact was. And, and now my TikTok thinks that I'm red pilled and homophobic whatever the fuck he thinks and now i just can't tell what videos are actually praising him and saying he has good ideas and which ones are being sarcastic it, it's all the same to me i need to stop putting chili powder in my mac and cheese and calling it gourmet i'm starting to leak blood and cough chili powder i need to start eating more vegetables i should have believed my mom when she told me that they would make me a big strong boy because now i'm a blind beta bitch as andrew tate would call me i need to stop chewing my fingernails as a kid my parents told me that if i kept doing it it would grow a hand in my stomach and now i have a sudden sensation that feels like what i can only imagine is a baby kicking i need to stop driving by homeless encampments with a dollar bill half hanging out the window and then peeling out I know it's wrong. I'm going to hell I'm going there anyway. I, I, f I feel like maybe have a little fun with it. Sometimes they laugh um, or maybe they're maybe they're crying. It's really hard to tell when you're doing 80 looking in the rear view. I feel like I need to start getting tattoos that have more meaning to them. I overheard a little five year old kid in Walmart telling his mom that my arms look like a sticker book. Now, if you're familiar with my channel, you know that I like to do drunk gaming videos and I feel like I need to start training myself in between those videos because I really don't drink all that often. Um, and I understand that drinking should be treated as a marathon, not a sprint. But just like regular running, I want to get it done and over with as quick as possible. When I go to Walmart, I need to stop yelling, I don't work here and refusing to use self-checkout. I understand it's really annoying and no one finds it funny. Um, I do, so. I should probably stop shadow boxing my roommate's cat and then being surprised when he randomly flips out and tries to scratch me. Um, I'm totally aware that it's my own fault. Um, but I don't respect blindsided shots like he takes, so you know what, fuck him. I should probably stop saying that every random person around me is an NPC, that as soon as I leave the current map, they'll just despawn. Because I've heard that this is uh, characteristics of sociopath, uh, sociopaths, and I feel like I'm walking a very fine line. I, I do need to stop dick riding Marvel movies. I understand that they that they kind of suck now um but i'm still in an end game hangover and and I, I i'm hopeful i'm hopeful and i understand that that makes me an idiot i do have quite a tendency to avoid things that other people are into not in like a uh, i, I want to be different kind of way i just have really bad opinions about things and i feel like the less people i have to share that with the more embarrassment i save myself from so i'll, I'll, I'll probably stop doing that I'm still not watching Stranger Things. It, it just doesn't look like a good show. And lick my taint if you disagree, because I don't care. I should probably also stop criticizing professional athletes because I can't hit a 95 mile an hour fastball or dunk, but neither can Joey Gallo or the WNBA. So they'll they'll still be receiving a, a heaping uh, pile of shit talk from me. I'm probably never gonna shave my head again. Um, I, I hate it and I understand that, you know, hairless creatures hardly survive in the wild um, besides whatever the fuck this thing is and Joe Rogan. So speaking of which, I probably should stop saying that I'm a natural born survivor. I have IBS and an addiction to Sonic. So uh, unless they got peach slushes in the wilderness, I'm I'm fucked. I should probably stop telling the Internet that I love women who can probably kick my ass. Um, I am aware of what a digital footprint is and mine is so bad that Helen Keller could track me. Also the fact that my parents watch my content. So hi mom, not on drugs because I ran out. Um, but you know that that's a start. Um, love you. Um, but I am going to go buy drugs now. So, uh, you guys have a happy new year.